He is defective, but I love him. <laughs> what? Hello, I don't know if you know, but I just announced that I have a new underachiever pin badge. It's so cool. You can wear it anywhere you want. You can wear it on the insides of your eyeballs if you'd like to. But yeah, click the link in my description if you want one. I think you do. Hello, underachievers. Hello, underachievers. <laughs> Today, we are going to be reacting to gay people. Ugh. I am... <laughs> I have made a lot of straight people angry. How have I done that? By existing. Not that bit. The other bit, by we making fun of them for not being okay. We've made lots of videos about straight people where we ask, are they okay? What is the answer? No, they're not okay. And has that annoyed straight people? Yes, it's annoyed them very much. Why is it annoyed straight people? Because they're snowflakes. What about the one where they were okay? I still got hate for that one, actually. But you can't make them happy at all, can you? I've also been told by lots of angry straights that I would never, never ever make a video, are the gays okay? Because I wouldn't, because that would be bad. Well, I'm not a hypocrite. So today we're going to be making a video about gays and asking whether they're okay. Are they okay? We don't know. We'll find out. By the way, I am bi. Huh. So I am I am also 95% gay. I'm mostly into men. Corey is bi. But I am gay as hell. Uh, I'm gonna be asking other gays okay. They're not. Spoiler. Yeah, then they're not. Obviously, we're just having a joke around. It's just a fun video. Is this gay okay? Tell me in the comments. I am not pissed off when I have to play gay character. I am gay. I just don't want them to force it. Also, it's not forced to play the straight character. It's normal. The default is straight. <laughs> I agree. Default is straight. <laughs> the fault. The yeah. fault in our straights. Put yeah. that on screen. I don't think straight is the default. To be honest, unpopular opinion, I think there are more non-straights than there are straight. I think every straight has a little gay in them, and I know that will upset some people, but that's okay. Just a little tiny Just gay. Just a tiny little... He climbed inside. He's living in there. Gay. I have a bit of straight inside me. I'm not scared to admit that. Obviously, we're just having a joke. The funny thing about this is that actually with most characters, they're, they're not forced to be gay. They're forced to be straight. Yes. Like, off the top of my head, I can think of many characters, many, many characters who were forced <laughs> to be straight. Star Wars, Finn and Poe, they were forced to be straight. Oh, We watched oh, The Maze oh, Runner. Oh, oh, Good Omens. Good Omens. They, they are gay. They... Oh, The Maze Runner. Yeah, The Maze Runner. Yeah, they're so gay. They're gay together. They're in love. Thomas... Brody Sangster and Thomas in the film. and Thomas in the film. They're, <laughs> they're gay together, and I'm not one of those people to be like, oh my god, I ship these like two straight people who are clearly like uncomfortable. They are gay. No, like they're gay. They're yeah. literally gay. They have a love arc, and then at the end of it, they just shove in some heterosexuality, and then he dies. Make sense. And then he, he dies. dies. Kill your gay. So this is a Facebook advert from Pride. It says, "Sorry, my heart only beats for my freaking awesome girlfriend. She is a bit crazy. She has anger issues." But she is a perfect mixture of sweetheart and warrior. I love her so much, and uh, she is my life. Flirt with me, and they'll never find your body. Yes, she bought me this shirt. See, this is very interesting because this is a this is a little bit of straight. I was gonna say this game. is a straight people thing. Isn't this is it? talk <laughs> to my wife, and I'll kill you. Do you know like how in in films and TV shows you've got gay characters that are very very straight, like in Love Simon, how he's basically a straight kid but he likes boys. Oh yeah, This is yeah, the yeah, t-shirt yeah. version of that. They've made being gay like palatable for straight people. By just... But, but by <laughs> making them abusive. You can't enjoy being married. You need to hate your wife. Otherwise, straight people don't get it. We are... This is a joke. It's just a joke it about... It is a joke. About straight people hating their partners. I don't understand the whole... She is a bit crazy. She has anger issues. That's not something you want to broadcast. Anyone that I'm close with, I don't want to broadcast their flaws or uh, perhaps their mental health issues to, to everyone that I meet on a t-shirt. Hello, my boyfriend has anxiety. He is defective, but I love him. <laughs> what? My dog pisses on the rug and I don't know why. <laughs> I'm going to buy you this t-shirt. Buy me that, what, with girlfriend on it? Yeah. Oh my God, please. So here is a gay pickup truck driver and he's got some gay stickers on his pickup truck. Gickers. Gickers. He also happens to be a furry. His stickers say honk if you're yiffy. I don't mind straight people as long as they act gay in public. Mm. I break for cat boys. Don't make me roll for initiative. Oh, this is, I like this person. He's got a sticker that says <laughs> bone me on it. No, I like this person. This gay is okay. Furries are okay too. I've met lots of nice furries, yes. 
I don't think I've met a non-nice furry. No, I've never met a not nice furry. So here is someone's text to their dad. They sent their dad a picture saying, Dad, I just saw this on Twitter. What is this? It's a twink in an old man's bed with the caption, iPhone 11, here I come. The dad says, we will talk when I get home. That's not a good way to find out that your dad is gay and also potentially cheating on your mum. And also having sex with people that are your age or younger. I don't think there is a good way to find out about that. Ooh. But I feel like that is a pretty bad way. I'd be more weirded out that my dad is sleeping with someone my age than him sleeping with someone who's a guy. Oh, I fully expect your dad to sleep with a guy. <laughs> Outing your dad! <laughs> my dad's not gay, he loves women. He's just not insecure in his masculinity. So, what is worse than a Tory? Oh, gay Tories. Yes, gay Tories are the absolute worst. By the way, a Tory is a conservative, a member of the conservative party. Like the Republicans in the UK, but not not as bad as the Republicans. But what's worse than being a gay Tory? I don't want to say it because it's just so much worse. I was going to say genocide. I mean... <laughs> don't even. I mean... Austerity. Oh, well... That is, that is kind of, you know, voting for a party that's kind of starving the health service and killing. Thousands of people. Starving the children. Yeah. Yeah. Mm, yeah. If you starve children, I'd say, you know. What I don't understand about gay Tories, with a lot of Tories, they're only not homophobic because they can't get away with it now. No, all you know, when, when Theresa May was like, oh, I, gays are okay. I'm like, Theresa, <sighs> sweetie. Look, a gay Tory is like being a snail for salt. You know? Wait, I want to see them looking like Tories. Wait, no, wait. Picture this, you're at a pride parade. I am there. You transported me. Love is in the air. Oh. Rainbows everywhere. Ah. Trans people walking Ooh. round in their binders. Look at them. Beautiful, beautiful people wearing coloured paint. Oh, I see them, I see them. What beautiful, vivid paint they're wearing. Suddenly a Tory arrived! Ah! This is in a Pride March. Uh, it's a bunch of Tories marching. <laughs> www.lgbtory. Oh! <laughs> Oh my god! The T in LGBT stands for Tory. No, 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 no. You need to say LGBT Tory, not LGBT Tory. Spot on! You know how it's like socially unacceptable to be homophobic nowadays? It's slightly less socially unacceptable to be transphobic. And the Tory party has not been too kind towards trans people. This is from Tumblr and someone said, Oh look everyone, it's the worst thing ever. This is disgusting. They all look so Affluent and middle class. They're super white. They're all middle aged. Not a single one of them has dyed hair, visible tattoos, or unusual piercings. None of them are visibly defying gender norms. They look nothing like the modern queer movement because they aren't queer. They aren't radical. They are normative as f and they're trying to convince us that they're here to help. That they're allies. Okay, so hmm. it is a hundred percent okay to be queer or gay or trans or whatever and not look like you are. You don't have to have coloured hair. Piercings, you know, tattoos, you don't need that. I that. disagree. Uh -huh. You're not gay unless you've got an unusual piercing, dyed hair, and whatever the other one was. <laughs> yeah. All punks are gay! <laughs> I don't agree necessarily with what this person has said. I think that is the the gays aren't okay. We've got a two-pronged attack here. We can attack both the gay Tories, who are um, lawful evil, and this person, who is chaotic evil. It's very funny to me that you see gay Tories who are advertising for LGB Tory clearly getting rid of trans people and say, oh, the worst part about these people is that they don't look visibly gay as hell. Yeah. There are more issues with Tories other than the fact that they they could be middle class and they look a certain way. They vote against the interests of LGBT people in general because of the privileges that they've been afforded. Minorities in general. So this is a picture of some two shirtless men and the caption is, the things I would do to these two hot f**ks. I'd tie them up in bed and make them moan until their balls have been sucked dry out of cup. Who knew I had a kinky side to me? That was on Facebook. I knew you had a kinky side to you because you posted that Publicly for everyone to see. Excuse the bad angle, but remember when I sucked a Hulk-sized dick and ended up in the ER afterwards? I remember this! I remember seeing these tweets! Yeah, me too. So someone said, your throat game must be extra weak. And he said, it's actually strong because the dude was a whole ten inches. Took the whole thing down my throat multiple times. But his dick ruptured my airways and caused loose air to leak into my neck, chest and underarm. And I finished him off, so next. <laughs> like, good on him though, right? Like, don't injure yourself doing sex, you know? Be safe, um, use a condom, don't rupture your airways. <laughs> yeah, this guy, this guy's got gay. Imagine having a dick so big that you can rupture someone's airways. Some of us don't have to imagine. This is a message to Blake. Blake, I hope you're okay. So, Blake said, I got and I sh all over his bed. What should I do now? Take a shower. There's 
on his bed, but he fell asleep. I don't know. Leave? I can't just leave my there. Okay, then lay in it. What the fuck are you asking me? What would you do in this situation? I have thought about this many, many times because I have anxiety about situations that will literally never happen. So I would pick it up with toilet paper or a towel and then put it in the toilet, flush it, then wash everything in the shower and say, hey, sorry, I sh in your bed. And then that would be that. Hi, are you a bottom? Where are you from? The Philippines. Heard about the typhoon. Seems pretty bad. Yeah, a lot of people died. What a f Well, I'm getting into character now and I'm thinking, yes, that would really help me take my mind off of the right. horrible untold destruction that I have faced. Grinder is the <laughs> worst place on earth. This isn't a gay men thing. This is a gay men on Grinder thing. Grinder is a place where the only thing people want is, is a little f can lesbians use the slur fruit? No, because it's a well-known fact that lesbians don't actually eat fruit. They all have scurvy. Fruit isn't really a slur. <laughs> I mean, is it? No. If you were a fruit, which fruit would you be? Pineapple. Hmm. You? I want to be a mango. Why? I don't know, I just like... Bruce so easily. Yeah, but there's that big, strong stone inside and such lovely flesh, I think. You know, a mango I'm ending this video now. <laughs> yeah. Thank you! Are the gays okay? No! Neither am I! Have a good day, I don't. See you later, losers. Goodbye. Buy my hats. Bye-bye.